hi all welcome to the channel so today in this video we'll be learning about how to enter text in input box then we'll learn about how to clear text from the input box and how we can press some key from the keyboard using playwright and python so let's do that okay so i'll come to this page and uh, so here uh, we'll be taking the site from the internet website okay so this has very good uh, very good features i mean like uh, if you have to if i just go to this page uh, the back page so you can see lots of options are there so we can try different different things to do like for example if you have to upload some data upload some files so you can try this option okay similarly now we will be learning about like how to enter some text so for that i am using this in uh, login right yeah so what we'll be doing we'll be entering some text here and also in the password then we will click on login so we are not doing the clicking but our our motive i mean what we want to achieve like we have to enter some text then we have to delete it okay and uh, we have to press some key from the keyboard okay that's three things we will be seeing so let's go here so again i will be using playwright code generator to get the template so this time we i will be using uh, pytest okay so playwright code gen and take the website So as you can see, the Playwright code generator opened this uh, browser for us. And uh, here I can come here and what I can do, I can select PyTest. So you can see it's quite compact and I will copy this thing from that inspector and then I go to this PyCharm and I just copy paste it okay and let's run name it as test or make it a test example that's fine we are doing some example as well only so no need to rename it okay so it's saying like we have navigated to this url now we have to enter some text so let's inspect it and we can see the id is there so we'll take the id and we'll make our css locator so page dot uh, we have to use page dot locator and then we need to pass this has and username so that becomes id okay and next we will use dot fill method okay so if i hover over it you can see this is saying this method waits for the function okay uh, so it's basically note that you can pass an empty string to clear the input field okay so here it's saying like uh, okay we can actually directly pass an empty string to clear the input field okay so this actually works as a clear operation as well so uh, both things we can do we can pass some value and we can uh, I mean input it in the field so let's say we want to write the username as um, username one any username you can give okay so next uh, let's run it and let's give some time delay to see whether it's actually entering something or not so import time okay so and let's keep time dot slipped so it's just for demo purpose i'm giving a five second delay and now i will hit here from here i can run it or we can run it from the uh, command line right so let me first close it close the inspector so let's try it from here first run python test or actually this is pytest right but let's see whether it's running or not yeah it's running but i think it will run in the headless mode 
probably because this is the page fixture we are using mm. okay no problem it's failing for some reason but as we as we already learned like we we are actually I mean as it is a pytest test so we can direct uh, we should use this terminal only so pytest minus s and then I can uh, use this headed so that means it is we are running in uh, I mean without headless mode okay that is means headed is there that means browser will be opening and if you do not sh if you are not sure about this pytest thing so you can watch my previous videos where I have explained in detail uh, how to use pytest and py playwright okay so just check in check my other videos okay so I am opening in the normal browser mode and if there anything extra thing I need to give yeah I want to give some slow motion so let's give a slow motion of uh, 500 milliseconds yeah that's fine yeah so let's see what is happening now yeah the browser got open and it entered username one perfectly so yeah our fill operation is working oh okay it's actually Actually, it's uh, opening all the all other test as we gave just pi test comment. Okay, so that's my mistake. Okay, so if you just give this pi test command and without giving the mentioning the file name which you want to execute, then it will scan all the test from my project folder, uh, whatever test is there. So it will just find this name, okay, test name, and it will run it. Okay, no worries. I will uh, just uh, give this folder basics and then we need to go to this test clear text okay so now this time it should just enter the username one and it will leave it for five seconds and it will close right okay so now let's see whether we can actually clear this text or not so we entered something next we need to clear it right so and after that we need to clear I mean add something some other things so what we can do we can just paste it here and then we can use it right as they mentioned like we just we can pass only note that you can pass an empty string to clear the input field so here we are clearing it so let's give a comment like clear input field okay and then let's enter again the correct username so, so let's enter the correct one is like in the they are mentioned Tom Smith so let's copy it and give it here okay and now let's run it and see whether this Tom Smith gets I mean Tom Smith should be there in the username field okay first it should clear the username field and then it should enter Tom Smith oh I did the mistake again sorry about that Yeah, I just forcefully closed it and uh, now let me go to the terminal and hit the same command again so it opened internet Heroku app and it cleared and it entered Tom Smith so it's quite easy right using this field command uh, we can just uh, clear it directly so no need to use a different method for it right so you do not need to I mean there is no actually is no such clear method available so if you uh, if I just do it like dot uh, clear so you will not get anything like that so uh, okay I will I will show you another way to clear the field okay that's a bit I mean complicated but 
uh, you can try it. So, and in that only I will be showing you this press press command. Okay, how, how to use this press method. So, another thing I want to show you first, there is a type method is available. So, you may get confused whether to use fill or whether you should use type method. So, I will tell you the difference as well. So, let me show you what what's this type method is doing. So, no, first I will let's let it be clear. I mean, let it clear first, and then let's use this type method. Okay, so if I enter Tom Smith and let me execute it, we will see the difference now. see username got entered now Tom Smith is entering character by character so that's the difference so when you need to enter character by character or just like you are entering from your keyboard so it will just uh, simulate that thing okay so uh, I mean so as as like the actual user is entering something so it will just uh, perform the same way so that's the difference between fill and type. So fill will be directly entering the text. So just like, I mean, normal send keys operation in sen uh, Selenium, but type method will be doing character by character typing. Okay. So, and also, uh, I think, uh, yeah, that's the main difference. And also we can see one more thing. So, uh, there is also delay operation is there delay option is there that means uh, we can give some delay in between this entering the text so let's say first it entered uh, there is there should be some default delay as well but we can explicitly give it and override it okay so uh, let me give the delay also so you will know like maybe if whenever it will require you can use it so let's give a delay of one second or two second let's give it two seconds and let's run it oh sorry again I did the mistake because I usually run my Python uh, I mean Python programs in this way so I am habituated with that so uh, let me go to this terminal as now you can see it's taking time of two seconds after that it open him so yeah it's quite kind of time consuming right so let me just close it or let me minimize it let 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 it perform okay so that thing we have used like type operation and fill operation we have understood the difference between these two now I will show you the press operation press method okay so um, what we can do we can create some methods or we can directly also use it uh, let's let's try it so let me first comment it out so I mean I'm just commenting it so that uh, it is not used okay in the code so what I will be doing I will I will create our own method for clearing our text okay so let's do that so what we will be doing um, let's use clear text and let's pass page and also let's pass this uh, locator okay so this is the locator we are passing and uh, let it create it mm -hmm. okay clear takes clear clear input text okay so we just created a function and here let's make the naming convention because this underscore it is required otherwise it's giving some warnings okay so we just created it and now let's use page dot so 
what we will be doing we will be clearing the text so one way to clear is like the fill method and the second way like first you should normally how we what we do manually let's say you have to clear this text so you just hit the backspace from starting or we just click ctrl a and backspace right that is also another way to clear the text so that we normally do in uh, manually right so let's uh, simulate that thing okay so okay so page dot press now what we have to press here we need to press our control button and alt a button right so we can take help from this website so we have page dot press selector key and KW right so okay sorry instead of page dot press we can directly have why are using page dot press so what we can do uh, we can use uh, we are passing the locator right so this is the locator and so page dot locator and then we are passing this locator so we just created this here and then in the inside it in the press button what we are doing okay so here we are seeing like it is giving the uh, whatever things we can do so we need to do the control controller a right so we can mention control plus uh, key a. okay so it is now pressing this control a and then what we have to do page dot locator and the locator so this locator is the so what we can do we can uh, uh, we can give the something like LOC and here we can make it LOC and this is LOC so this is the locator which will be when let's say it is a XPath then it will pass the XPath if it is a CSS then it will pass the CSS and then we are pressing uh, backspace right okay now use it and see whether it's working or not it's working and it's uh, entering this uh, Tom Smith character by character so we'll just close it and let's update it with the fill method and here fill method also has I think delay uh, no there is no delay thing so let's remove it and let's run it once again yep so it entered the Tom Smith and it cleared the field as well so we have seen two ways to clear a field uh, first way is the fill method that is the recommended one and in some case maybe if this is not working or maybe you want to try something else like we see the example of press method how you can use you can press some key from the keyboard so you can use this method whenever you need to use it I hope you liked it. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.